how to write quadratic equation in standard form. First, write the quadratic term, then the linear term, followed by the constant term, equals zero. This is the standard form of quadratic equation. Is this in standard form? Let's check. This is the quadratic term, followed by the linear term, then the constant term equals zero. So this is in standard form already. Now, what is the value of A? A is equal to 1, the value of B is equal to negative 1, and C is equal to negative 3. This one is also in standard form. In this case, there is no linear term. The value of A is 1, B equals 0, and C is equal to negative 16. Let us rewrite this in standard form. You are going to transfer negative 5x squared to the left side of the equation. In order for you to do that, use the additive property of equality. You can add 5x squared to both sides. Okay, write 5x squared minus 2x minus 9 equals negative 5x squared plus 5x squared. Then, just copy 5x squared minus 2x minus 9. Then, negative 5x squared plus 5x squared is equal to 0. Your quadratic equation is now written in standard form. 5x squared minus 2x minus 9 is equal to 0. The value of A is 5, B is equal to negative 2, and C is equal to negative 9. How to write this in standard form? Transfer 6x plus 18 to the left side. So you have to subtract 6x and 18 to both sides by additive property of equality. Copy x squared minus 6x minus 18 equals copy 6x plus 18 then minus 6x minus 18. Just copy x squared minus 6x minus 18 then 6x minus 6x is 0 18 minus 18 is 0 so the answer is 0 this is now written in standard form x squared minus 6x minus 18 equals 0 the value of a equals 1, B equals negative 6, and C is equal to negative 18. Another one. Multiply 2x and x, that is 2x squared. Then 2x times 4 is... 8x equals 0. 2x squared plus 8x is equal to 0. This is now in standard form. The value of a is 2, b is equal to 8, and c is equal to 0. Last example. First, multiply x minus 4 by itself x minus 4 times x minus 4 equals negative 8 then x times x is x squared x times negative 4 is negative 4x 
negative 4 times x is negative 4x. Negative 4 times negative 4 is positive 16 equals negative 8. Then just copy x squared, then negative 4x minus 4x is negative 8x. Copy positive 16 equals negative 8. Then transfer negative 8 to the other side. Again, copy x squared minus 8x plus 16. By additive property of equality, you are going to add 8 to both sides. Equals negative 8 plus 8. And then, copy x squared minus 8x. Then, 16 plus 8 is 24. So, you write positive 24. Negative 8 plus 8 equals 0. So, this is now written in standard form. Where A is equal to 1, B is equal to negative 8, and C is equal to 24. That's it. Thank you.